Alright, it's Antline Alpha. Welcome to Let's Play Banjo Tooie Part 39E. And how's it going? Everybody! Seems like everything's in order in life, doesn't it? I'd say so. I'd say that's a fair thing to say. I'd say to say it. I would. Okay. So I guess we will be going in this little tunnel after l after all. I don't see any reason not to. Since it's... It gets us closer to... Dad entrance. With the gobes. But we're not going to be able to interact with the gobes just yet. Oh, that, that thing, that thing! That imp! Hey. The imps are useless. They don't even, you can kill them, they don't even give you honeycomb. You can kill them and kill them, but they will never give you honeycomb. Alright. So this train set. Hey, read it. Read it, please. Freight service economy industries will get on over here. You don't need no freight service over there no more. Alright. Okay, we got a cutscene. And he's choo chewing along. Choo choo! Choo choo for me! Yes! I love that choo choo! Choo choo choo! Choo 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 choo! So. I had a couple dreams uh, lately. I won't go into too much detail about them, but I'll say two of them that I'm going to talk about. I'll just talk about three, just like brief little things about them. Two of them had to do with Banjo Tooie. Uh, I'll, I'll mention the one from uh, uh, two nights ago first, since. That, uh... Let me see, can I get over there? Alright. I managed to not take damage. Yeah, the font one from a couple nights ago. I had a dream that I was doing this challenge with one of my friends on, like, a level in... I think it was, like, Rusty Bucket Bay from the first game, but I... But, like, you had all the... Like, egg types from this game... Because I remember I had... Oh, come on. I had to use ice eggs to defeat... It was a bulb orb from Pikmin, but it was in, in Rusty Bucket Bay. And basically the challenge was... Uh, it was a self-imposed challenge. And it was... You weren't allowed to grab any, like, egg nest to refill. You had to work with whatever you had at the... when you came in. Oh, whoops. And so, yeah, I almost... I ran out of every single type of egg, but I had seven ice eggs left. Can I grab this? Oh, really, then? Yeah, drown after you burn! Okay. So... Get your dead on. You can grab this. I like how all the empty honeycombs are on the lava side. There's that one where you need to come out from the ice side, but still, like, on the lava side. So yeah, there was uh, another dream I had about banjo Tui when I was in San Diego. It was, uh... Th I... They... These people, like, found the original, like, I don't know, it was like the lab, not the lab, but like just the works, they found like Rareware's, all their notes and stuff from when they were making the game, and they figured out like the code to put in the ROM to make it so... By the way, this alien's gonna die, and for some reason he act he says activate jetpack, but it doesn't do. Oh, well, I just realized that the jetpack activates after he lands. Huh. 
That's kind of funny. I don't remember seeing that before. Anyway, um, yeah, people found, like, rare workers' notes and, like, the code to put in that would work with the banjo tui rom and it would add, like, I think there's, like, two or three beta levels, and so they, they put the, they attach them to a new version of the ROM for Project 64, and, uh, and they put it up for download so anyone could play those beta levels, and I remember playing one level, and even in my dream, I was thinking to myself, yeah, I can see why these are beta levels, because these kind of suck a lot. Like, there's like this one underwater room in this one level, and it's, there was just like four jiggies in a row just lying on the floor in the water room, you just swam and, or swum, whatever it is, and collected all of them. I was like, wow, that was really easy, and there was like no, nothing to that, so I was like, it's just kind of a waste of time to implement new levels into the ROM, but whatever. So yeah, that's two out of three dreams I was going to mention. Uh, the other dream had nothing to do with Banjo-Tooie, and it was instead about um, me sleeping over at one of my friend's houses and he he was like i don't know not a vegan because this wouldn't make sense if he was if he was a vegan but he was like into organic stuff and natural stuff and he had this toothpaste and it wasn't toothpaste at all he basically it was mealworms in a tube, and he brushed his teeth with mealworms, and I was like really, really disgusted by this, and I almost puked, and I didn't end up doing it, because I don't want to brush my teeth with mealworms. So, yeah, that's uh, that, that, that right there is what we call a minjo. Yes, we do. By the way, this place is called the Icicle Grotto, and I'm really not sure what classifies a grotto, because am I missing notes somewhere? I don't know. But yeah, uh, I thought a grotto was like an, an underground cave, cavern type of thing, but it seems like, because this one is, uh, this one's, like, in a mountain, it's not underground, so I don't know, like, though, the things that were called grottos in, in Zelda games are underground, so, I don't know, and here's, Kind of weird. Yeah, 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 you know what? Go ahead. Go ahead and just stop in the middle of air. In the middle of the air. You know, everything. Everything was logical in this game up till this point. Well, as logical as a bear and a bird collecting puzzle pieces to stop a witch can be. But I mean, we didn't have things that spat in the face of science until now. So, I don't know what your deal is, banjo Tui. all of a sudden. But this is gonna be what separates you between a 8.5 and an 8.0. No, I'm just kidding. But, let's get our 
treble clef. Okay, seventy, seven, seventy. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not fall victim. Let's get lined up, lined up, lined up, and lined up. Oh, some eggs. But, 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 but I don't need no eggs. I swear that turned into grenade eggs before I collected that, but it still gave me fire. Oh. Well. Wait a minute. Oh, this must be where it leads to the honeycomb. I must I missed this th my during the practice. Is it indeed honeycomb land? All right. There we go. We've collected all three empty honeycombs in this segment. I feel nice. I do. Okay. So out here there should be no move. I'd be happy if there's a new move. I'd just be so ecstatic. All right. Give it to me, ba gl gl jam jars. Now you're lifting no big fat bear. Easy it'll be to glide through the air. Jump up high and then hold Z. Don't need fly pads or feathers red. That will be all. Thank you, Bog. Ah, jam jars. Why do I keep calling him bottles right now? What's happening to me? Is my body going through some changes? I don't know what to think. Uh oh. Uh oh. Alright, so we'll just go ahead and do a leg spring, and look at that a ginger. Yeah, that'll be nice. Okay, whoa. Thank you. Now roll through this ass. This ass. How am I doing on health? There we go. Full it is. Full it is indeed. I swear I'm missing some notes. So I am instead not going to take the warp out of here and just backtrack all the way out the side. Whoa, were those, those sort of things were like right next to each other. I don't want your charity work. And by that I mean exclamation honeycombs. And by that I mean skill stop honeycombs. But it's all okay. Okay. Is this the thanks I get for working overtime? All right. Let me just check up here once again. And then okay. I guess I got all the. Notes in here. I guess just the trouble clef was in this grotto, and we are grateful for the grotto full of a trouble clef. Okay, so we'll be moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on, 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 and on, and on, and on. But don't flip that off switch just yet. Cause there's a thing or two we can do more. Okay. I don't want to go up there. I'm fine with not going up there just yet. Oh, here's some notes. And I. Oh, yeah, I know where the rest of the notes are then. That'll be good. That'll be good. Hurry before the ice dragon gets tired of breathing. Let me just... I think he only breathes four, so I think we're too late. Oh well. I'm big of foot. I have an almost foot. That's nice. If it is, isn't it? And if you try to steal my shoes, you'll be seen a closer. But those shoes won't even fit you. I don't care. You're not having them. Come on. Let's go. Let's go! Let's go! Let's feel it! Let's feel it, shall we? Ah, you breathed your four hail balls. I'll just wait patiently 
I will shoot a ice egg at you. You gotta get frostbite eventually, even if you're good at ice living in. There we go. Okay. Nice. Ooh, ooh, ah! My poor enormous foot! Yeah, it looks like the... It looks like the... Shoes were... Were translucent, so even if you... Were able to get them... You... Couldn't. Because it wouldn't let you wear them. Oh, yes! Thank you. And now for the gobes. Where's that gobes? Where's that gobes? He's coming around here. Uh-oh. Whoa. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm gonna keep on plopping. Yep, I'm jumping over you. Wait, I wanna plop near the gobes. Just let me plop a little further. Just a little further. Ah, uh, yep, that's good enough. Okay. I'm fine with that amount of plops. Please. Oh, please, don't do it. Oh, I'm doing it. Took me since the last game to save that. Ah, yes. Seems to have cooled my boiler enough. I'll let you take the chuffing train to the ice side now. We don't know nothing about no ice side train tracks. Anyway, that's, that's enough for me today. Thanks for watching. Ding, bang, goodbye.